Now to a CBS2 exclusive. This is a scam that we first told you about last month. A tow truck company charging exorbitant fees busted. And now we're learning that scam goes even deeper. CBS2 Sabrina Franza live for us outside City Hall with those details. Sabrina. Marie, we first thought this scam was all about those crazy prices. I mean, we told you about one woman's tow truck bill that was almost $58 thousand dollars for a tow and that scam busted in part by the work of the Department of Business and Consumer Protection which work in this building behind me here at City Hall. Now we're learning that the scam goes even further. Another victim coming forward saying that someone from AP Towing and Recovery didn't just tow her car but drove it as his own. I finally get my truck back two months later. Alicia Howard hasn't been home since August when her car was towed by AP Towing and Recovery. She says they know where she lives. It's a fraudulent tow trunk company busted by the Department of Business and Consumer Protection and other agencies for operating as a scam, towing people's cars to a city owned lot and charging exorbitant prices. Kind of creepy guy, so I didn't feel comfortable about him. When Alicia's car was in an accident, she says the towing company wouldn't let her see her car or get it back. They've been driving my car since the day they took it. Then she started getting different kinds of bills. Then I get a letter saying that I'm speeding. Then I had two letters tell me to show up in court. Speeding tickets and I pass bills, notices to show up in court. It's like I'm being penalized and I ain't do anything. Some of the charges dismissed, but she says more keep coming. When she finally did get her car back, it wasn't even totaled. It did, she said, smell like cigarettes and had stickers and fingerprints all over it. I don't know who it was. Random phones synced to her Bluetooth. I haven't even took the writing off. All these fingerprints and stuff is not mine. She just wants the person driving the car and the company to be held responsible. Back when we first told you about AP Towing and Recovery, we also told you that an owner and a tow truck driver were both arrested and charged for trespassing because they were working on city-owned land. Our sources tell us both of them were released. Meanwhile, Alesha's bills, they keep coming. We're live in the loop. Sabrina Franza, CBS 2 News. What Marie. a story. Sabrina, thank you very much.